All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James. And Brush. And today we're going to be watching Encanto. Um, obviously, this was like ridiculously highly requested. And I stubbornly was like, you know what? I'm not going to watch it when everybody's going to watch it. We're going to wait. <laughs> we're going to wait for the hype. Right <laughs> <to leave. laughs> um, no, but this has been all over the place. It's the new Disney movie. It's really big. Uh, Lin-Manuel Miranda did the music. I don't know what to think. To be honest, I wasn't like, like Moana was a good looking film, but it wasn't like crazy for me. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, I don't know yeah. about you. He did the music for that. So I don't know what to think. Pixar is always usually a little bit more my style um, than some of the later Disney stuff, but we'll see. I'm interested. Obviously, mm -hmm. there's a lot of hype around this movie, but yeah, um, I'm excited. We're kind of taking a little bit of a, a vacation on our Pixar bench because we were going through all the Pixar stuff. So we'll probably be going back to Pixar stuff next week on the polls and different things like that. But yeah, um, I'm excited. This movie just came out. Went straight to Disney+. Plus. Um, so yeah, full-length reaction is going to be up on our Patreon. Next week's reaction, whatever animated movie you guys pick, this movie here is also going to be up on our Patreon. And yeah, thank you for joining us here. Thank you for watching, and let's just get into Encanto. So like, how recent was this? Like this j literally came out like four, three months ago. Oh! Like this is like the okay, newest okay, Disney okay. movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's okay. I no, it, it's like the newest craze. Have you seen anything for it? Like any of the trailers or anything? Oh, really? Okay, so I've seen some of the trailers. I okay. get kind of a vibe for it. I know that we don't talk about Bruno or something. Anyway. Oh, okay. <laughs> Abdel your sword. Open your eyes. I was so scared for a second we got like the Spanish version. Oh. <laughs> this candle. Kind of the miracle given to our family. Whoa, that's cool. That's, isn't that cool? Long ago. The, with the shallow focus and everything, that's really cool. babies have yeah, just like, yeah. been born. <laughs> and your abuelo was lost. Wait, that's but so cool. The candle <laughs> became a magical frame for the <laughs> in which to live. Oh, isn't that man. sick? <laughs> and our house came alive to shelter us. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Yeah, this is like that's this is the all I know. Like, oh, a special magical house. They got magic too. <laughs> that's right. Okay, interesting. Our family's gifts have made a new <laughs> home a paradise. I already really like the coloring of everything. It's got like a, a special certain palette and it's, yeah. it's really good i really like these like particle effects that yeah. look like um you know how if it's blurred in the background yeah, yeah, yeah. Make my family proud. <laughs> <laughs> oh. whatever gift awaits will be just as special as you <laughs> this is so cool it's a cool the sort of lighting and Dang! We got like opera? I mean, that was sounding real epic. <laughs> that, that was a dope title card. Oh! <laughs> clean! Okay, you know, I could clean my room if it did that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, I already love this girl. Okay, give me a house like this. Does it do the laundry too? <laughs> like. Dude, I love the. Uh, the like the colors and everything. Like Very, I don't even know. Yeah. I think this might be Ecuadorian, but like when we went to Mexico, like there is stuff like this, and it's yeah. it's so cool. As oh. it should be. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of digging this music. <laughs> <laughs> Same. I can't either. Tell me. Why coffee's for grown-ups. <laughs> <laughs> we don't talk about grown-ups. They see you saw the future. Okay. <laughs> well, that's true in real life. Just imagine how I feel, Mom. <laughs> oh, dang. That's clean. They're really using the medium to make these these musical numbers. Like, no, yeah, awesome. yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> Wait, who's the sister and who's the cousin? There's so many people. <laughs> the kids just doing the exposition. Yeah. 
She's got like flower stuff, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, Luisa we just that. jacked. Dang. The choreography. What did you get? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. What are you doing? Dude, she's vibing. Mirabel didn't get one. Uh, are you <laughs> just gonna drop that? I gave you the special since you're the only mother got a kid with no gift. Okay, well, you don't gotta be a prick about it. <laughs> Why are we rubbing this in? Last gift ceremony was a bummer. Last one being yours, that, that did not work. Dude, stop talking. I'll be really sad. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe your gift is being in denial. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dang. I actually feel like she seems really chill, though, compared to the rest of them. I mean, it may be wrong, but I'd hang with Mirabelle. Okay. <laughs> oh my, she was waiting for that. You know how long she was waiting for that? I'm sure. Oh, it's nothing. If you weren't always trying too hard, you wouldn't be in the way. Speaking of oh, trying too that. hard. I'm not in the way. You are. <laughs> She's right. On First gift what? Feastings. My man, yeah. Allergic. Give him some food. Give him some medicine, bro. That's why I'm saying the medicine will heal him. Oh, I'm serious. Okay, oh yeah, I'm true. Give him the mama's it. cooking. Get some enchiladas. Yeah. Yeah. Remember, you have nothing, you have nothing to prove. Like I, I think, <laughs> it's like guys, leave her be. Like actually, I think it would be fine if they didn't talk about it so much. Yeah, I mean they're just worried. I know, but it's one of those things where it's like talking about it makes it worse. Of course. One hour. Oh oh, oh no. The best way for some of us to help is to step aside that stinks man like if the gift ceremony doesn't go well this time tonight would be hard for us so. all because like the future or something yeah but i feel like they're too caught up on the gifts right like if if you lose all of your value because you don't have gifts then you now you're not using it for the right reasons. You know what I mean? Yeah, but the, the thing is, they've been reliant on it. It's like... No, but like know. before, they weren't reliant on it. That's my point. No, I now know. Now they do rely on it. it. It should be a bonus. Yeah, but like, inevitably, you will rely on it. Just like anything, kind of. Huh? He's getting his gift, right? Or he's... Tonight? Supposedly. And it's gonna be the coolest ever. Good for her, man. I know you're an animal guy, and I made this, so when you move into your cooler room... Dude, she's so awesome. something to snuggle with. Well, quit eavesdropping, house. All right, hombrecito. You ready? Hombrecito? I haven't heard that one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's just this movie, but, like, I was looking at the animation... Uh -huh. it, it it seems even more detailed than I've ever seen it from Disney. Where like like the eyes, like her eyes will look a little bit back and forth, like you do when you're when you're in uh -huh. real life. Like you know how your eye twitches a little bit. No, like yeah, little yeah. stuff like that, and the expressions I feel like are so 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 accurate. I mean, I feel like they they've done they've been doing that. Okay, maybe I'm just maybe I appreciate it more now that I've been watching stuff with you. No, yeah, I, mean, so I haven't good. seen some of the latest stuff also. So. <laughs> The such thing is that, like, you know, the, it's almost like you're what people don't want to be. And yeah. so not only are you suffering, like, just in of yourself, but, like, you know, like, the kids are worried that they're going to end up like you, right? That's kind of, like, that feels really... Yeah, but that's why I, I, I said that it's, like, I think the mistake is that it's it's become more than a, oh, my gosh, look at this blessing. Now it's, like, a it's a dependency. And so then if you don't have it, you're lacking instead of... Right, special. Yeah, I mean, it's because I feel like they're they're utilizing their gifts so much, and they're so like, yeah, they are so dependent on it, kind of. So I wonder if uh, possibly, possibly that's why she didn't get it. Like, I wonder if there's a point to it. Yeah, right? because we did get this miracle in like a time of need. Yeah, they're just emphasizing the importance of the gifts too much. Okay, okay, bam, bam, bam. okay, okay, bam, bam, bam. All right, I'm done. <laughs> I love that effect on the candle. That's oh, yeah, so yeah. Cool. it's really That's such cool. a smart really idea. Beautiful. 50 years ago. What do you think? He, does he get a gift? Moment. I have no idea. I say no. I say I say they screwed something up and they're not going to get any more gifts till they fix it. Maybe. 
as another steps into the light to make us proud. See, the fact that she says that, though, like... <laughs> Yeah. Like, does that mean she can't make you proud, right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, it like it, it's too, not like... just the fact. It's it's the way they're framing it. And I do yeah. kind of blame Abuela. Yeah. Especially. <laughs> Dude. It, it shows how much... Oh, okay. Oh. Can you do that? I need you. <laughs> Dude, go. Go. I mean, I'm worried. Like, if she if he doesn't like get it, like, they're gonna, they gonna blame, blame her. her you know, yes. like, well, right, screw bro. them. That's bull. I'm worried, bro. Please. It's so beautiful that like, like you know how hard that is, and it's like the fact that she can keep a brave face for him. Yeah, it's so awesome. <laughs> I mean, this is it. This proves. Okay. Okay. Right? Yeah. Animals? He, he can understand animals or something? Uh -huh. <laughs> I understand you. Oh. Okay, so now I'm sus and Mirabelle. Like, are we sure that she didn't get a gift? Especially because the gifts seem to have to do with at least their personality or something. He likes animals. Yeah. I'm not sure, but the, the one thing I, is like... Because she didn't get a door, you know? I'm, That's true. It's weird, though. Yeah, like, you would wonder why so is it Now I'm confused, her? actually. Now I'm like, okay, what's up? Yeah. Because freaking Mirabelle, I'm sorry, besides this little dude, she seems like the coolest, hands down. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure the other family members are cool. I honestly? Oh! It's like a jaguar. Dude, this is literally every kid's dream. This is crazy. Whoa. See, this is just actually beautiful. Yeah, it's very like, beautiful. Like, this is a beautiful animation. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Wait, you get this entire, like... Dude, I keep feeling worse and worse for Mirabelle every time I see any of the other stuff, though. It's like you have a jungle. I mean... <sighs> a gift just as special as you. See, the fact that... The fact that it's as special as you. Yeah, because then it's like, okay, then... Without the gift, you're not special. Of course. See, it's the way that they're, like, they're putting it. And she's not even in the picture. Yeah. Well, that's awesome. <gasps> Wait, this is so cool. <laughs> this is such a cool sequence. Yeah. It's like she appreciates it more. Yeah. Well, because it's like, if you know, if you don't have Of course. It. I also wonder, though, like... Yeah, but then again... Like, like should she be waiting? Like, I, I, I totally understand. But it's like, dude, I feel like you can do so much. Like, look at how she helped her nephew. Yeah. Do you like, really it, need like, a like, gift, right? Like, do you need a miracle? Is it falling apart? Yeah, what the heck was that? Ow. Ow. Whoa. It's like falling Whoa, apart. dude. I mean, what's up with the... What's up with Bruno? Well, we don't talk about Bruno. Exactly. Oh, shoot. <gasps> Is it going out? Uh-oh. What happens if it goes out? Then they lose all their magic. Yeah, right? right? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's got the moves. Does it have anything to do with Abuela or whatever? I like, feel like a little bit, dude. Like, the way that she's treating but Mirabelle no, but especially. Still, like, <laughs> the house is in danger! And the candle almost went out. Show me. What? Are you kidding me? The cracks were there. <laughs> There is nothing wrong with La Casa Madrigal. The magic is strong. So, I don't I feel like it's like it's like this this close line between like I don't know if she's she's just smooth and like likes to give appearances or it's like that bad kind of like just appearances. Uh -huh. I don't want the same for you. Could it have something to do with Bruno, right? 
I, you know what's awesome is that I actually do think the mom really cares about her, no, and that that yeah. is cool that she like. I think all of them. I really think it's a well a little bit. I mean, I think the like the majority of them do care for her, and no, this is the thing: is they're actually not doing anything wrong. No, they're just being kind of self-involved as opposed to like not even aware. No, but they aren't right. They're using their powers to help other people. You know. Yeah, but is it for? Is it truly selfless? I mean, it might not. I, be I think truly it's selfless. not because guess what? You don't have value if you don't have powers. Crux in our casita. If our family knew how vulnerable we truly are. Wait, what? Help me save our miracle. That was cool. I will save the miracle. <laughs> Let's go. I see. The thing is, I feel like. Wait. How do we save a miracle? <laughs> I feel like this sort of like self selfishness or whatever you want to call it. It's not really selfishness, but no, it's it's like she doesn't want to accept that their miracle is dying. Yeah, and she's yeah. kind of proof of that, right, or yeah. something possibly. It's it's hard. I mean, I'm sure we're gonna have a giant discussion. Ah, uh, but maybe you heard about it. Maybe I should know about it. Camilo. Stop pretending you're Dolores or you can have second. <laughs> <laughs> oh, snap, darn it. The only one worried about the magic is you. And the rats talking in the walls. Um, and Lisa, I heard her eye twitching. Hold it. How does this lady sleep? Like, that's gotta be Isn't horrible. I, I love the aesthetic of this movie. And I'm sure that's like part of the cultural thing, but the way they're using the colors and everything oh, is, yeah, yeah. is just stunning. Any chance you maybe know something about last night with the magic? <laughs> Bring you to the front of the class. <laughs> That's like, gave me flashbacks to school. So, <laughs> we, we, we are this is such a sibling <laughs> thing. <laughs> not right now, not right now, just wait. Dolores, do we have a date? Tonight. He wants five babies. <laughs> <laughs> We'll bring a new generation of magical blessings. Will she though? Stronger. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Freaking Louisa. Maybe you should just go home. Louisa, my house is leaning to the door. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it leaning? <laughs> You're gonna make me drop a dog. <laughs> No one's hurting the magic and it gets worse because you won't tell me what's wrong. Nothing's wrong! Ugh. I'm totally not nervous. <laughs> I'm the strong one. I'm no oh, dings. And I blow because I know what my worth is. <laughs> <laughs> the doggies. <laughs> the doggies. Dude, this is so dope. <laughs> Well, because it's like, if your entire identity is caught up in what you can do, well, like, in your powers, it's not even what you can do, it's like your powers. We'll have to talk about it, because... <laughs> the donkeys are just along for the ride. <laughs> That's so cool. This is so sick. What's the everybody in the moves, dude? <laughs> the donkeys can dance better than What's me? Like. <laughs> Okay. Oh, the 2D little moment. Luisa, the donkeys! On it! Oh my goodness, <sighs> leave her be. Before Theo Bruno left, he had like some terrible vision about it. <sighs> what was in his vision? The fire going out? Yeah. We, we got to talk character stuff at the end for sure. Yeah. But that montage was incredible. Like that was a dope song. And and I, it's, it's awesome. Wait, is he in there? Yeah, he's, it's. I mean, I'm assuming there's like. They like just literally world. straight up lock him away? No. No, it's gotta be empty. No, there's like a tower or something, right? Because these rooms are like portals. That is true. You know? You can't help in here? Huh. Well, because it's like not part of the house? I guess. Did he separate himself from the casita? Or did they? See. Dude! It's not a good start. <laughs> what? Oh, hello. Hey. 
a lot of stairs. No way, immediately. <laughs> if only you had the flying gift. It's just like me working out. Dude, why did you have to? Why did it have to be so high up here, bro? Like, oh my gosh, did you see? She's a little. She's got some Indiana Jones. Yeah, I love that effect. Whoa, that was kind of superhero landing. Oh, uh, Bruno, you need to like. You need a decorator upkeep. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh! That's a little odd. Is he a hobbit? I feel like he's not here. Well, or maybe he is. Do we know exactly what his power is? Should we should we change our mood lighting? To green? <laughs> the immersion. Oh dang! Wait, he can see the future, right? Or something yeah, like that? Supposedly, we don't know what his power is. What is that? Is she making it worse? I don't know. But like... What? What? Wait, what? Yeah, what are they? I don't know, I have no- Oh, maybe they're like his prophecies. Maybe? Oh, dang. Get the last Shoot. one, get the last one, get the last one! And where is he? Oh no, that's not gonna... Shoot. Oh no. Go, 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 go. Whoa, careful. The individual ah, sand particles on yeah. her face. Oh my gosh. Where are you coming from? In such a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. I was, what uh, is in your head? Leave me be. I gotta go to the bathroom. Go. But then when I went to throw the donkeys in the barn, they were heavy. <laughs> oh no. What did you do? Don't blame her. Why am I in your fishing pool? Whoa. <laughs> the way she does her little hands. We need to get ready for the Guzman. The house can clean itself. We don't talk about the Oh yeah. It was my wedding day. Oh snap. <laughs> the boobs. The butt. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> this is so cool. Whoa. And the way the camera tilts whenever they say Bruno. Yo, dude, he's right up there. <laughs> He's vibing. The thing is, they're not really explaining anything. Well, he like they're he, saying bad things, but none of it's like concrete. Like I'm trying to like actually see what he does. <laughs> yeah, but he's just telling the truth. I mean, I can understand why like. My dreams would be promised and someday be mine. Of course he did. He Oh, shoot. I want not a sound out of you. <laughs> you suck. This is so sick. Put Whoa, it together. This is cool. Hey, we gotta figure this out. Some sort of image. Is she the source? I don't know. No one will know. Just act normal. No one has to know. Yeah. Huh. She always knows. She's gonna tell everyone. Time to eat. Not now, okay, but there's yeah. time here. like, don't go okay, in, like... so, I, th I honestly think, like, the way they're all looking at Bruno's power, it's like, oh, your fate is sealed, or uh -huh. he's just telling the future. Uh-huh. Right? Like, couldn't it be both? I feel like that's the same thing, isn't it? I don't know. They, they do it like it's almost, I don't know, they're talking about it like it's his fault. And it's like, well, if he sees that you're gonna trip and you trip, is it his fault you tripped? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh no. Guys, why? <laughs> <laughs> guys, they're gonna die. No, stop, guys! Guys! Oh, oh no, oh no. You know it. Oh. She's just excited for you to propose. Uh. I was actually gonna. We're actually gonna. <laughs> Wait, what? What if he likes her? No. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, what are you guys doing? Oh, no, this is really, This is like... This is a Thanksgiving. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, I'm a loser. What did you do? It was your guys' fault for talking about it. Yeah, why did you guys, like, bring it up? The magic is strong. 
everything is fine. Yeah, I mean, she's like a little bit in denial. Well, I mean, remember, if the magic isn't strong, they lose everything. Even the land that they're standing on, remember? So they literally won't have a home anymore. That's true. And that means all those people That is true. Are gone. I mean, I, I also, I don't know how much the extent of it is, right? Oh. She said the rats on the walls were talking about it. <laughs> Whoa, that was that sick. Was cool. Wait, that was so cool. Whoa, he's got like parkour moves. <laughs> I'm still curious as to what his powers yeah, are. Yeah. Dang Shoot. it. Oh my gosh, careful, 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 careful. And who said you're oh. not special, bro? Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bruno. Bruno, you dude, have come to on. come back. You're very sweaty. Oh, oh no. Um. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought she straight up dropped him. <laughs> Bye. All right, this something's up here because he looks way chill. A little salt. <laughs> He's like superstitious. Super yeah. superstitious. How long have you been back here? Clearly. <laughs> A decent amount of time. His friends are rats, okay? He needs a little bit of help. I don't <laughs> understand why you left but didn't leave. What if he can't leave? Maybe. Huh. He's right there. I had this vision the night that you didn't get your gift. Okay. And there was no one answer, no clear fate. Like your future was undecided. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> I'm Bruno, and everyone always assumes the worst. Yeah. You left to protect me? It's like he was doing the same thing that she was doing for the other. Yeah. I mean, because, I mean, the stuff that he would say, they thought, like, when he said it, it kind of, like, brings yeah. it about, kind of. Look, if I could help anymore, I would, but, um. I like how, like, different he is. Yeah. I mean, he's been secluded for a while, so... Yeah. I need a big open space. We'll find one! Where? This is my room. The yeah, I mean... Me I knew it. Don't eat those. <laughs> <laughs> what? You should have told me the second you saw the vision. Think of the family. I was thinking of my daughter. Yeah, he was thinking of his family. Don't, don't talk oh, about her. Yeah. Yeah. too hard on me, I mean. We must protect our family, our encanto. But do you think being hard on Mirabel did any of this? Mm. What if I show you something worse? <laughs> Gabby Bears. You're gonna be all Bruno makes bad things happen. Oh, he's creepy. Dude, he's the only person who's almost weirder than her. Because, like, or, you know, they think is weirder than her because his powers are negative. Uh -huh. So it's like, I feel like she understands him. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I thought he was taking his shirt off. I thought he was gonna go like... <laughs> Taking the jacket off. All right, dude. Stop showing off your fire animation, Disney. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> oh, dang. This is so epic. <laughs> the capybara. Okay. It's just the same thing. I gotta stop. No. No, keep going. Keep going. Keep going, keep going. Yeah, but is there an answer? Over there! Yeah, what is that? Butterfly! I, I, I think you're gonna help the candle! How? Uh, there's, there's someone with, with the you. butterfly. You, you're a fighter! What? Wait, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> to make the candle bright, you have to embrace her. Embrace who? Oh, huh. Isabella. Isabella. No, oh. Isabella! Even worse. I was gonna say. Our family got a miracle. How do you help a family miracle? You hug a sister. <laughs> Maybe because they're not getting along with each other. After I saved Miracle, I'm bringing you home. <laughs> <laughs> I like how, like, everybody in the family is kind of like an over-dramatized version uh -huh. of the family stereotypes. Like, there's always the weird uncle. Uh -huh. so, like, <laughs> I mean, this is going to be a little bit of a struggle here. I don't know if this is actually going to work. Because she's really... It's got to be... I feel like it's got to be something. It can't just be like, hey, hug me. Let's hug it out. Huh? 
I mean, I feel like they have to come to an understanding or something. Out? Luisa can't lift an empanada. Mariano's nose looks like a smashed papaya. Have you lost your mind? Everything was perfect. Well, you pretended it was perfect. Apologize. I am sorry that your life is so great. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Selfish. I've been stuck being perfect my whole oh. life. Oh. <laughs> Whoop de do! It's the most negative flower ever. It's not symmetrical or perfect. With the guitar? Like it's like punk or something? The electric guitar? Whoa. This is so sick. Dude, the animators must have had so much fun with this. Like, it's such creative freedom. Yeah. It's like, dude, Mirabelle is like the most real of all. Yeah. Somersaults in those giant dresses. Oh dang! Yeah, it's the way that it's like she can help all of them. How yeah. much you want to bet, dude? It's the way they've been going about it. Maybe the clock started with you. Bruno left because of you. It's like the house represents the family, kind yeah. of. Yeah, you know. And she, well as breaking it up. Yes, right. Bruno left our family because you only saw the worst. No, you pushed him away. <gasps> oh, dude. Uh oh, that's gone. Dude. It's gone. Because you're right, it represents the family. Oh, Whoa. that's what she saw, remember? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Go, go, go. <gasps> oh, <laughs> it's a strong bucket. You have to save it, otherwise, hurry. Oh, no. <gasps> Dude, this house is clutch. It's falling though. apart, it's still saving up. Yeah. No. Wait. Oh. Okay, that looks like real life almost, dude. Oh, no. Dude, it's not your fault. I mean, in a way, that big, because she she pushed it to that, it kind of. I, I guess it's just not that simple. No, of course it's not that simple. It's not. It's not. And like look, her everything else is still fault. fine. So that's what I was thinking. I was like, okay, the Encanto's gone, but like, look at everything else. Like, there's still a great, beautiful valley with fruit and grass and like. No, that is true. If the valley itself it doesn't go away, yeah, it's like then screw we're fine. the powers. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. And he stopped him, man. I was given a miracle. A second chance. <laughs> Mirabel. She accept me here. That's so sick, oh. dude. The colors. That's the just light. beautiful. <laughs> and I think that's like little Bruno instead of like what what what's happening <laughs> <laughs> don't lose Bruno yeah don't lose him yeah. another time that's sick Can't say we don't have a house. What if we got lots of people to build it? You too. Yeah, it's like it's like that like misdirected love, you know? Yeah. Some gift just you. Huh. Miracle is you. So we gotta talk about room now. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> I 
Hey. Hey, it's like Sometimes. editing. <laughs> Need a little bit of that. Okay, she's the best. Wait. Oh, I was waiting for you to arrive. I was like, what? <laughs> when you stalk him on Facebook. <laughs> The reflections. What do you see? <laughs> I see me. Oh dang. Wait, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> Oh dang, even the casita is popping off. Hey, it was always popping <laughs> off. <laughs> She's got some like tie dye going. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There's gonna be so much time. This is gonna be I can already yeah, tell. This is, really, uh... <laughs> this is gonna be a this is gonna be a one division discussion. Um what'd you think? So Overall. I mean I mean, do you want to do you want to just talk let's talk about, technicals like, technicals. first? Yeah, I want to yeah. talk technicals first, and then we can talk about like themes because there's actually a ton to talk about. Okay, so the models and stuff, like the it, it, really clean, right? I mean, that's one thing though that I feel like you know it's up to date, right? That's am I crazy though for thinking this? Because obviously, three D models, uh, right? You you make the model, it's done, simulation. But I think they did. They were doing a lot with like with uh, like like uh, like powdery substance. Like like at the end when she's sitting in the ash. No, yeah. Like that stuff, I felt like was taking the three D models to another level, or like the well, little particles of sand on her. Or no, is that totally simulated? I mean, I I, I don't know about the particles of sand. Like that's that's like this. I. I'm assuming they got to do that. Yeah, you know? so that stuff was, like, hard. I mean, that was good. It was really good, and the models looked really good. Um, the animation, uh, I thought, was really cool. Uh, yes. Just the, the creativity. Yes. Right? And the the movements and stuff. It, it felt, of course, the movements felt really real. I mean, it was, like, it was borderline, insane. like, It was insane. Like, there was a few life, points. Right? Like, when, when there was a few points where it was, like, yeah. if their eyes were exaggerated, it yeah. straight up looked real. And then, like, um... Just the, like I said, the creativity. I mean, it, yes, it's dude. really good. I mean. And that's what we always talk about. I like, love that. I love that sort of stuff. Because sometimes with 3D, it gets a little, it, you can get lazy. Not well, lazy, I mean, but but you can get. You strive a little too much for that realism aspect. Whereas with animation, I feel like what I've always loved and what I really like about 2D is that you're almost forced in the medium to be creative. Mm -hmm. Sometimes for budget, sometimes for time, whatever. Yeah. I did feel like. Of anything that's come out of Disney in a long time, 3D wise, this was uniquely creative. Yes, it was. It was very uniquely creative. I feel because it I wasn't didn't. just hey, slap the beautiful 3D models, film your basic shots. It was like okay, here's what we want to display. Let's use every aspect of this 3D animation to yes. show that. I mean, let's utilize like the transitions. Yes, the sort of like movements, the fluidity, the colors, like everything. It felt very like it felt very animated. Yes, right. And I really, I really do enjoy that. It makes it a lot more fun to watch and to kind of like admire as far as like animation yes. goes, right? Yes. Um, and then yeah, the colors. The colors were very like beautiful and vibrant or something. Yeah. It. Like I said, the only thing I can think of, and and I think it's Colombian, is is where this is supposed to take place. But like, it reminds me of Mexico. Like actually, it's like they took those pictures. They'll even do these, like, they'll make these things out of beads where they'll use, mm -hmm. like, a rainbow of colors. It's like they took that color palette and just went, like, like yeah, yeah, all yeah. over the animation. Oh, yeah. And then yeah. it was super striking when they went back to your traditional. So, like, when it cut at the end of that pressure song to the dark red, it was like, whoa. Yeah. Or even with Bruno, it was like, whoa. Like, because because everything was so colorful and so, like, bright and sunny and beautiful. Yeah. And, like, whenever they had any just, like, solid color, it was, like, it, it, it had a really deep effect. Yeah, there was that contrast. Yeah. No, for sure. Yeah. Um, so did you like the music? I dug the music. Dude, the music was really good. The music was really good. Like honestly, my favorite though is like that. Um, what's your name? The pressure the, song. Yeah, that's yeah, dude, that was really the legit. Like I heard the Bruno. I've actually heard a few of the songs, and that's when I was like, ah, I kind of think maybe we should watch this. Yeah. Um, I really think 
this was really I personally I think this is so much better than Moana because the, that's the other movie that uh-huh. Lin-Manuel Miranda did so it's kind of hard not to compare at least music wise I uh-huh. think this not only is like up there with some like it's it's like wow okay Disney you did you're back um, but I think it's a lot I think he upped himself from Moana yeah to I put mean, it in a I positive way like, I, I don't, don't want to be like oh Moana sucked I wasn't a huge fan of the Moana music uh-huh. and I think this was like really creative and great. Yeah, it's hard for me to like kind of compare because I don't really remember. I don't remember like especially getting into the music. As far yeah, as I would like, say I the difference yeah. is you don't remember, but um, Moana and you might remember this. But this one, yeah, you know for yeah. sure, I really, yeah, especially that that uh, <laughs> song. That was, that was really good. That was sick. Oh man, I really liked the characters too. I thought all the acting was good. I thought mm-hmm. the characters were really well done. Um, there were a few really subtle moments that I really appreciated mm. at the beginning. Like the moment, the, the the scene of the bed, like that was such a beautiful scene. Mm-hmm. Um, but they had a few silent moments, and you don't see that a lot in Disney. And I really appreciated it with like Mirabel just sitting there and like hearing Abuela talk about the magic leaving. Like just having moments like that felt very different, and I think like took like moments like that really elevated the story. Yeah, I mean, I feel like subtle moments always do that because it's not like. You're not treating your audience um, like especially like they're dumb or something, right? It's like I mean, obviously, it is like a it's geared a little bit towards younger a younger audience, right? But I like that you know you can still have those those subtle moments where you don't have to outright right tell because well, well, it just, ten- yeah yeah it kind of rich and en- enriches the. The experience. Yeah, I mean, I feel like the temptation with the kids' movie is to constantly have something going on. And so that having those moments of quiet, I was like, oh, that's very unique and, and really well done. Yeah, and honestly, I feel like, oh, well, I mean, I don't know about all kids, but like a, a decent amount of kids can appreciate Kids pick moments. up on that sort of yeah, stuff. Yeah. Because they like, do it in real life. They can pick up on when you're angry and mad yeah, and, or whatever. Like, they're not they're not dumb. I just feel like uh, sometimes like the kids' shows, you know. And that stuff I actually think challenges them, which mm-hmm. is really good. No, yeah. Um... So, time for family therapy. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to. I I've been thinking this whole time, like, how do I? Where do we? I have a lot to like. You start, because I know you'll have a very different approach to it than me. Okay, no, I want you to like go, because I don't even know where to start, bro. So I, okay, so I will say this: I okay. liked the arc, the idea. Um, people may hate me for this. I thought it was a little bit, a little, little bit on the nose at the end there. Um. Okay. But I did still like it. Uh, as far as, like, message goes and stuff? Yeah, like, okay. where it was like, okay, like, it's really, like, Mirabel. And it's like, dude, I was rooting for Mirabel, but it was a little bit like, okay. I mean, there, um, yeah, it kind of felt like... Whereas for the rest of the, the the other parts of the movie, it was really well done. It was, like, mm-hmm. subtle and everything. Um, so that threw me off a little bit. I liked it. I, I thought it was interesting. Um, I liked the way they did the, the Abuela. Um, uh-huh. I really thought they were just going to be like, see, this is bad. Or it wasn't. And I liked that they made a point to go out of their way that it's not like she doesn't hate you. She does love you. But you have to understand that people from a different generation, people who have been through, this applies to every culture, every family, um, different things. And usually for older generations, much more intense things. Yeah. Um, whether it's like, okay, your town is burned or whatever. Uh and so I like that they highlighted that, and it's like it's not a angry thing. It's it's a they've seen bad things, and so they're holding on a little tighter. And I liked that aspect of it. I thought that was a really interesting, nuanced way to approach it. Yeah, I mean, because there she is um, very kind of you know strict as far as like her ways and things like that. Yeah, and you you know you have that, but you do realize that like you know they've lived their lives. You know, and something has made them kind of like that, right? And you have to understand that. Yeah. And it's not necessarily that they're trying to harm you, restrict you, you know what I'm saying? Or, um, you know, stop you from doing something. It's kind of like they, I mean, it's just like a parent saying like, no, like you can't eat too much candy. Or yeah, something like and that. And I liked that because I think the low hanging Disney fruit would be to be like, F the parent, have your freedom. And I, yeah. I like that they t- made a point to be like, look, it, it is a little more complicated than that. I mean, I feel like, I actually feel like 
Um, Disney doesn't usually... They are usually pretty... Um, how should I say? Like, they don't... Everyone's usually got their story, kind of like. Yeah. You know, usually. You know what I'm Just saying? These Disney he likes the kids over the parents lots of times. But I mean, look, that's just personal. Yeah. Whereas this, I don't know, it felt different than than other Disney stuff I've seen. Okay, yeah, yeah no, for sure. I Yeah, I enjoyed her character a lot. Um, I am... I was glad that, like... Yeah, that they did take the time to kind of... You know, it's not like what she was saying was completely wrong. No, I liked that. Right? And it's like... I mean, this is the one thing also... Well, I don't know if we want to segue into this whole conversation. Let's go for it. I, I Look, there's conversations we have. There's a reason people are talking about it. Look, we're going to be real. We're going to have our conversations. It's like the Snape conversations or any other conversation we've had. You don't like it. I'm sorry. We're okay. Real. Well, I mean, like, so the whole gift thing, right? Having your gift. Yes. You know, I mean, you can, there's a lot of ways you can kind of take Interpret that. Interpret that. Yeah. Because <laughs> like, there's a lot of ways. Like, you can say, like, a gift is, like, okay, a bonus thing, right? Yes. And it's like. Um, you know, a lot of the family felt like they were relying too much on their gift. And mm-hmm. so because of that, it was bad. And if it gets taken away, they're nothing. Or yeah. Something, right. Mm-hmm. But for me, I mean, it's kind of like in the end, your gift is also a part of you. And so, I yeah. mean, it's kind of like, you know, let's say I hone my skills or whatever, for animation and let's say i have a talent i was given this talent right that actually is true a lot of people are more a little more naturally talented at certain things like that right does that mean that i can't rely on my talent to enhance my individuality so here's where i took it and maybe i'm wrong this is how i kind of took it though is that it's not in in the in the animation, it actually totally didn't completely work. But if you apply it to actual real life, it works a little better. Yeah. Um. It's like the, the the balance, right? Go back to this a billion times. But it's like if you like, for example, I love movies or whatever. But uh-huh. like, actually, this happened. With, let me be real. This happened with YouTube at the beginning. Um. We've been trying to get a YouTube channel going forever. Oh right? yeah. Four and a half years after trying, this thing starts taking up. Um. And I remember being into it, and it took kind of a dive there was like a lower point and it was like i i was so like it it was seriously affected me like i was so bugged i didn't understand it i couldn't fix it it was just frustrating me and i think that it was kind of a point of realizing that that it it your entire worth can't be in that that can be your talent and you're right that is part of who you are Right, I still am a YouTuber. Whatever, I, I like movies. I I think I have a talent for directing. Whatever, you you have a talent for animation. Mm-hmm. But it's like if you if you like if that thing went away, are you still a person or are you completely hollow? Because it's like I think if you lost your animation skill, of course that that is a huge part of who you are. But it's not yeah. all of who you are. That's and I think true. that's the point they were kind of making, right? Because if they wasn't, they wouldn't have given them the talents back. Yeah, I'm just thinking like, you know, even if we did take away their gifts, they were using their gifts. They weren't like, I mean, unless you want to talk about the one, the sister, right? But the rest of them were trying Louisa to help people yeah. out. No, not Lisa. Oh, no, no, Lisa's Lisa's the strong one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, she was a little bit like, a little bit, I don't know, kind of full of herself at times, right? Yeah, because I mean, she, she felt like that's what she had Yeah, to I mean, be. but... It still was a little bit. We can say that, but like, you know, in the end, like, you can only fake so much of who you are. And I feel yeah, like there's a, yeah, li- yeah, yeah. there's a little bit of like ego in there. Okay. Yeah. And so, but other, the other family members, I feel were, you know, they were genuinely helping people out in the community, mm-hmm. right? With their powers. Mm-hmm. And so it, it got me thinking was like, okay, so you're saying that if we take away these powers at this current moment, because they ha- have not like, um, had any character development they are nothing no i think that was the point is that they still are 
And so, so from Abuela's okay. point of view, that's what she was worried about. That's what she got obsessed about, just the powers. Okay, so are we saying that, like... Well, I wasn't sure exactly what the movie was trying to say. I felt that's... like that's what it was saying, because they, look, they rebuilt the home with their bare hands. No, yeah. And then even there at the end, it's showing Louisa helping them out, and everybody helping out with their powers, but then it, like, showed her take a break. Like, it's like that balance where um, there was... There, uh, that I don't know. I kind of took it as like, like if you use the job analogy, like I said, it actually completely doesn't work for the animation as gifts. It works a little bit better if you actually just <laughs> apply it to I think what they were talking about. Um, yeah, it's like you know there are more things in life than my job. There's family. That's there's true. kids. Yeah, there's okay. beautiful things, and that's why she was like, "You're the gift." Screw. Like obviously the gift is a thing. Okay. Obviously no, I'm see. talented at animation, but it's like guess what? Like me, like dude, I want to get married. I want to have a ton of kids, and it's like, yeah, I love movies. Would I put that aside in a heartbeat for kids and a family? It's like yes, because there is more to to life than than movies or that gift. I guess. Okay, I I think. Okay, yeah, so I may be was... totally superimposing my own thing, but I kind of felt that's what it was. So then. It was more like um, trying to um, convince them that they were more than their, just their gifts. It wasn't saying yeah. that they were... And I think that's how it tied to Abuela, right? Because she was like, we have this opportunity. Like, you have this gift. Okay. You have this chance. And so she became obsessed with We're just the results as opposed and... to the thing itself, okay. essentially. And so because uh, of that, I, that yeah. pressure bled down to everybody, right? Because the expectation is use that gift, not like be a rounded person, like a well-rounded person. No, yeah, yeah. I think I just, I, in the middle of the story, I kind of like got the wrong, I got no, the wrong message. I mean, it was really complex. And so I do feel like that's part of it. And that's it kind of the benefit and maybe a little bit of the confusion as well. Well, yeah, it does. It, it is. Because um, everybody's really complicated, cl- like complex. But it does make sense what you're saying because it's kind of like they're kind of saying like you're not yeah you're not just your gift because of that sort of um, even that picture at the end that they took it yeah. was kind of like it's imperfect messy. it's messy right and just like how Louisa or whatever but it's real yeah I think that was part of it too actually is it's the messy but real thing right like like Mirabelle is is the she's not even that messy but comparatively let's say she is the 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 epitome of that right uh-huh. where it's like she is real she is genuine and like there does come a point where i still think there's like some place like the, the one thing that i'm a little bit like okay there is a place for kind of like ritual and like that kind of stuff i do think um uh, what like, do you mean like, like tradition and no dressing of course like, like there is a place for that. that um wait and I don't know but what this movie they... is necessarily saying about that. I don't know. What I, it I, is. Didn't, I didn't. But I definitely anything. do think it's like, you know, there is an extreme of that, which is like, no, okay, dude, it's just got to be perfect. I don't care. Nail your ears to the back of your head so that they look or whatever. Like that extreme kind of perfection for the sake of instead of being like, dude, okay, you know, whatever. Yeah. I mean, I just, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's for appearances, just... right? It's the wrong reasons, too. It's not perfection because you should strive to be. The best you can be, right? It, it's perfection for clout. It's it's social, right? Like that, that sort of almost shallower motive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like to make sure that other people think that you're perfect or something like that. Yeah, right? yeah. I mean, because everything was about being like you know, yeah, just more balanced. I feel like yeah, with like yeah. Louisa, like which is, more is why breaks, I, I right? like like uh, Mirabelle was an interesting character because she wasn't. Um. It was kind of like a backward story because a lot of times, I mean, I actually don't know with a lot of princess movies, but with your classic story, right? You got your hero, you get your flaw or uh, your thing yeah, you have yeah. to overcome. But in a weird way, it was like Mirabelle was like just normal. Um, well, I guess yeah. literally with the magic world, but like she wasn't, she didn't have a flaw. She was just like, like she was cool and relatable and like normal yeah. um, in really every respect of the term. And so... It was like everybody else, it was like everybody else was having it. Like she was the catalyst for their arcs, mm-hmm. which was interesting. I don't know. It's very interesting telling a story that way. Yeah, it is. It is because it's like she wasn't, 
and I don't mean this in a, a mean way, but she wasn't anything like there wasn't something unique. She or, sucked. No, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, but in a weird way, it out of the was ordinary. right. So, so but that's because, the other thing. Because yeah, exactly. if everybody's super, then the person and who isn't was, is unique. Yeah, her normality was special. I feel was like abnormal. I keep accidentally roasting her. <laughs> It's kind of like um, the people in the beginning. <laughs> Dude, that's so funny. <laughs> they're, they're like, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I So I will say this. I'm a little disappointed. Okay, I liked Bruno's character. Uh-huh. But I got a little excited because I was like, oh, are we, I, Disney has lost their villains and I want a villain back. I want a, a kick butt I villain. Agree. Like an evil freaking villain. In one of these movies, and I got excited for a little second there, like especially when they were telling the stories, I was like, oh, dude, he looks super cool. The green eyes. It's like, I actually do like the character, and that was well done, but I wanted, I wanted yeah, Disney I mean, villain. That's what I mean. Like, I feel like they always, you know, they have a lot of times what they do, um, at least recently, is kind of like, no, I haven't watched a lot of recent ones, but, um, you know, they have their sides of the story kind of like, which is cool. I like that. But, you know, I feel like in the end, sometimes there has to be someone with their story, but they're still... They're still wrong. Yeah. I mean, because that's... It feels, like, real. And it's cool, too. I mean, heck, I just I want to see another... Like, Especially because it's a kid's story. Right? So I think yeah. maybe that, that a little bit clearer... I thought this was really well done, actually, in this case. No, yeah. Like, I didn't like, need I sometimes anyone have, to be like... I, sometimes I am like, oh, you're going to show the villain side. But, like, this actually, I was perfect. Because I was like, no, but, like... People actually do do that, and she wasn't yeah. really being that evil. I mean, I didn't. We didn't need a. There, there wasn't a villain actually yeah. in this movie. It there really was just like conflict and family struggle, but it wasn't a. There was no villain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There wasn't really a villain. I mean, you can't call her a villain. No, she, I mean, she just yeah. You, yeah, you can't call. Otherwise, everyone would be a villain. If people yeah. make mistakes, you know, it's just that's just how it is. And once again, motive, right? And so it was, yeah, it was course. a. It's not a selfish motive. It was a selfless motive. Like she really was, did care for them. Yeah, and so that's really, yeah. I I really enjoyed it. I liked how the the. Oh, here here's my controversial question. Okay. Which sibling are you? Comments. Sibling are you? <laughs> oh my gosh. No, because I feel like they did kind of like. Do Cover a really good job of, of like having some goofs with like that archetype, like the weird uncle. There's always like that one sibling that is like the model sibling. There's like the the quiet, like I don't know. I feel like they got not all of the tropes, but like some of those tropes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I mean, they got some of like the tropes, pretty definitely. spot on. Yeah, who are you? Who are you? I don't know. I, it's kind of tough. It's kind of tough. Honestly, I was probably leaning. uh Louisa. Oh, because of your uh, physical, like, prowess? <laughs> no, I'm like the little kid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of... I was thinking of Bruno, but, like, if he's the weird uncle, I'm pretty sure <laughs> I'm not the weird uncle. I mean, I don't know. Everybody's going to disagree with me. Be like, what do you mean he's the weird uncle? <laughs> I mean, because he... Uh, yeah, I definitely think you're right. He kind of is... The, A like, little bit. You know, not even like, that weird. It's kind of funny. I mean, he, she called him weird. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know, are you a little bit like the dad, like Mirabelle's dad? Oh, uh, yeah, like the dad. He's pretty, like, yeah. chill. He was pretty normal. Yeah. Wait, did he have a gift? No, because they married into the family. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, did, true, uh, true, true. Oh, what was the, the lady with the, 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 the rain clouds? Who was her, who uh, do we know who's, like, her husband? Because I got to make friends with that dude. <laughs> yeah, 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 that guy. He's so dope. <laughs> he was funny. I forgot. Yeah. No, that was good. And then the whole, like, I, I I did, like, the theme of, like, the, um, you know, like, the cracking up of the house. It's It kind of, like, represents the family, you of know? Of course, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's, like, you know, it's not like there's some special, how should I say, like, because of her being here, it ends up destroying the, it's, like, no, it's, like, the family's kind of breaking apart and, you know, it's splitting. <laughs> But I liked to that. That was another thing. Like there were a lot of themes. That was another thing that I actually really liked is that it was like, dude, sometimes you do have to to, to deal with that. And mm-hmm. I liked that. And where it was like, up. dude, sorry, yeah, I am gonna destroy the house, but we need to. Like, yeah. let's deal with this now. Mm-hmm. And I liked that idea of it. As and that's well. why I was saying it was technically her fault. But like, I'm not, and I'm not saying it as like a negative thing. True. You know what I'm saying? That is true. It was just that was kind of cool. I, I kind of like that, and I think like maybe the cracking in the beginning was probably because of like her and 
What's her name? Isabella? Yeah, you're right. It's probably, like, because they were fighting each other or something. And then it, like, got really bad because, like, Abuela was, like... You know what I'm saying? That's true. That's, I like that. It was kind of cool. It was kind of I subtle. like how the house got scared of Abuela and fixed itself. <laughs> she comes out and like, no, nope, we're fine. Everything's okay. <laughs> hey, the house was a real one, bro. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the like... story would be over if it wasn't for the house. Okay? Can we just talk about that for a second? I mean, like, realistically speaking, let's be honest here. Everyone would just be pissed that they have to, like, do their laundry. That's do the say, how it should have ended would just be like, I can't build a house. No, I can't even do my laundry. Even, I uh, even Vera Bell, like, she'd be like, wait. It would just, it would just be Abuela. Abuela would be the only one. <laughs> Vera Bell's like, but I can't grab my sandals. Like, they, <laughs> did they ever have to do any of their, like, chores or anything? They're out here like, dude. It's like, I got rid of the house. Everything is good. You know, our family's Dang back together. it. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Here, like, tosses the dish to like, ho- hopes it's going to get caught, you know. Just, <sighs> that's the bad ending. Oh my gosh. Ends up splitting the exactly. family, actually, because they're like. <laughs> oh my no, gosh. Yeah, that, was, that was great. That was I actually, I really enjoyed, enjoyed that. And I really liked seeing that sort of uh, passion in, in this animation. Yeah, definitely a lot that. more like. I don't in, know. in Disney animated, and I re- yeah, but I liked that. So yeah, that was that was a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching. Uh, hopefully, I got some of the music in. I don't really know. Copyright's a nightmare, especially with music. But I'm gonna keep in as much of it as I can. And um, yeah, thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching. As always, the full length reaction is gonna be up on our Patreon as well as next week's animated reaction. Whatever movie you guys vote for, this movie here. And yeah, thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching. If you're new here, welcome. Hopefully, you stick around, like, and subscribe. Uh, I just, I totally thought of like a cringy, like, oh, can I do it in Spanish? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, on that note, <laughs> canceled. <laughs> no, thank you guys for watching. Stick around. We got tons of different content if you're new here. Seriously, tons of stuff. And yeah, thank you for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.